We have a fantastic evening here in Hellöja. And we even spotted an elk or a moose or whatever you want to call it. We have an elk over there. Can you see it? A moose or an, is an elk. And, uh, it's like a summer evening. It's like a summer evening. I will show you around a little bit here. Look, and you can hear the birds. There is Jeanette. And uh, yeah, and it's completely still here. And uh, up there was the elk. And yeah, I will go forward here as well. And that is the narrow entrance which we came through. And we have the mountains in the background as well. And even over there. So this is kind of magic you can't believe that you are so high north and it's like 20 degrees the only downside is the temperature and the water it's only nine degrees so i guess we won't go swim no we don't not yet anyway some rain yes and yesterday was such a beautiful uh, uh, evening it was like summer, summer yeah. yeah so I'm glad we really made the most of yesterday yeah. afternoon and evening but we did not we didn't swim in the water because it that's only nine degrees yeah. Yeah. I was tempting because it was so warm mm -hmm. so let's go again taking off the anchor out there oh there might be a little wind we'll see when we come out if there is anything to say long the anchor is coming up Anchor is loose and the rain is picking up. We'll see what she says about uh, how clean the anchor is. Are we doing good? Jeanette says it's like a summer rain. I don't know, but uh, yeah, 
Summer rain happens so fast. Da -da -da. Coming through the next little small, we came out there, now we're on the next one. So it's a little zigzagging to come out here. We're sitting here and learning about different moon faces. Yes, and the pronunciation in English. Yeah, so if the moon is increasing, it's called waxing. Waxing. And if it's decreasing, it's it's waning. Waning. Wax waning. Yeah, we have to pronounce it, pronounce the A's and, in and, a different and remember way. what is what. But waxing could be like waxing vexa a car. in Swedish. And so waxing that, a car. Yeah, but what that has that to do with getting bigger. But vexa, waxing, that would be growing. finally made it to Tromsø. Yeah, we did. That's like the last step before Svalbard. But uh, so we're just approaching and we will uh, spend some time here because I think it's not the uh, time to go to Svalbard yet. <laughs> and we would like to uh, go home mm. for a couple of weeks to hug the kids and everything yes, like that. Yes and uh, maybe say hello to some friends as well and parents and parents of course and uh, and then we'll come back in, uh, in uh, and end on June yeah. and uh, look for weather for uh, Svalbard and that will be an interesting uh, trip we think so we hope you subscribe and uh, follow us yes we do so we are a little excited because we kind of just decided that we are going home and tomorrow that is so we will um, yeah we need to prepare uh, and going home for three weeks and then coming back and then we're doing Svalbard are you excited I am very excited uh, very it happy. feels lovely and I'm going to wash my hair <laughs> yeah, because you don't want to come home with a dirty hair. That's not. No, no, I don't want to fly with dirty hair. <laughs> no, but we're preparing now and then uh, going home and see the kids and everything. Yeah, and that would be really good. Can't wait. Mm. We haven't been home since September, so and and now it's it's uh, which is it today? June, sixth of June. Yeah. So it's the national day of Sweden today. And our engagement day. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm.